Oh man, what's going on guys? It's your boy James here, Beards and Cars, back with another video. If you guys are new to my channel, thanks for subscribing. If you guys are just stopping by, please consider that subscribe button down below. Now, that being said, guys, in this video, we'll jump straight off into it. This is going to be a product review. This is from Beards and Whiskers. So, Dennis over at Beards and Whiskers was nice enough to send me out these products. Now, this is one of those videos where I kind of got mixed emotions about so you know sometimes you hate to do these but this one here isn't completely a negative review i just want to put this out there everybody is different and i'll explain that in the end of why i'm saying this but let me just jump straight off into that so this is his bottles right here i know it's probably hard to see so this scent profile here is cobalt mint and this one is basically just what it sounds like it's it's a minty profile but he describes it as Cobalt mint beard oil is infused with winter mint and peppermint essential oils for a rush of minty freshness and a touch of bergamot for a subtle citrus edge. Now, <clears throat> I'm not real sure what bergamot smells like, but I did get the mint. I got everything he said in there. It's right in this package. So if you're a peppermint guy, this is a good smell here. Now, the next one, guys, is going to be pine country. This is going to be my favorite out of all of them. This one here, when I hear pine country, I'm thinking about you know, outdoorsy smells, stuff like that. This one he describes as uh, forest pine themed sandalwood and a touch of rain. A great pine wood scent with a bit of sweetness. And that's pretty much what I gathered up out of this. It's a real nice, um, it's not too outdoorsy. It's got a little bit of sweetness and a, like a real small touch of, to me, seems like a, not a cologne, but just a real faint undertone of something in there. I can't pinpoint, but it's a really good smell. So this one out of the three is by far my top favorite out of these three bottles here. And then the last one I'm going to talk to you about is going to be the one that I really didn't want to, I really didn't want to pinpoint my finger on and, and, and try to judge this because this is where everybody's different. Okay. Everybody's beard's different. Everybody's skin's different that type of thing so i actually had a small reaction to this scent i don't know if it's because it's so strong or what the case may be but this one here is called peliquero all right this one here he describes as leather coffee sweet tobacco and bay rum so i got a lot of those i don't know if i really got the bay rum but the coffee and the leather is like it's on point, man. That's what you smell as soon as you open it. So when I open this one, even here in the scent profile, when I open this one, that's exactly what I got. Like you're going to get like that. It feels like you're almost, it's a really rich coffee smell. Like a good, it's a good coffee smell. I've smelled other coffee smells that are just too powerful and I didn't like them. This one here is a good rich coffee smell, but it's got that real nice tone of leather in there. So the scent profile on this is right on par. It's top notch. But the problem I have with this is the skin irritation I got. You know, like I said, I don't know if it's because it's super high concentrated or what it is with this, but my skin didn't like it. I had to wash it out. I didn't have to do the other ones like that, just this one here. Now, like I said, guys, everybody's skin's different. I have a lot of allergies. My skin's sensitive to certain things. I'm not real good with, you know, really strong sandalwood, stuff like that. I don't know what it is, but this one, like I said, it's got an awesome smell to it. It just, something in it my skin didn't like, and I'm not sure why that is. But nonetheless, I appreciate Dennis all their beards and whiskers for sending these out to me. They'll still get used except for this one here, the Pelicuero one, if I'm pronouncing that right. It's just something in there, man, my skin don't like. The scent profile is awesome. But what I did want to tell you guys is out of everything I gathered up with his company here, he has, and Dennis, I'm sure you're watching this, an amazing feeling beard with these oils. So... If there was anything out of these three that I would not change for sure, it would be whatever the oils are in here to make it feel like that because it feels amazing in your beard. The scent profiles are there. Pelicuero, I don't know. Like I said, I don't know if there's something too strong in there or what, but my skin just didn't like it. And uh, yeah, other than that, amazing company, guys. Got some good scent profiles, just three easy right there, something real easy to pick from. And yeah, with that being said, see y'all in the next one.